Hello everyone and thanks for watching Edupedia World videos. In this video, we'll discuss solutions to the questions in paper 2 of the 2014 JE Advanced Physics Question Paper. Let's do the final question of this physics paper. Uh, this has to do with the velocity of efflux. This is a height capital H and then here you have a hole in a bucket of water of height small h and water is coming out and it goes like this. So we know what the velocity of efflux is. V is root of 2gh. Right. And how much time will it take to fall here? The vertical velocity initially is 0. So h is equal to half gt squared which means t is equal to root of 2 capital H by g. And this is the speed. So the horizontal distance covered will be vt which is root 2gh into root 2 capital H by g and g and g cancel and we get root of 4h capital H. Right. And the questions are given lift is accelerating vertically up, accelerating vertically down. What is this value of d? It is root of 4h h and the values of capital H and small h are given as, no wait a second, the question is when the lift is at rest this is equal to d. 1.2 and then you keep it in motion which means the gravity is changing but we see that the final answer vt or d does not depend on gravity so it will be 1.2 in every case except in the last case where it is falling freely when it is falling freely this won't even come out because this speed will be zero right and you can't say that this is zero and this uh, this speed is zero and so this whole term uh, will cancel g and it will be this term because there just won't be any water coming out so there won't be any d right so no water leaks out in case r s which is 4 but in all the other three we'll have 1 which is d will be 1.2 because it does not depend on the gravity as the gravity decreases the speed decreases but this distance increases right because the time taken to fall increases sorry the distance remains constant because time taken to fall increases so the answer in this case will be 1 1 1 and 4 which is option C this completes the physics portion of the 2014 J advanced paper 2 thank you